and enjoying rainy season also. Okay, there is uh, rain outside today, and I am feeling also good because last few days we we fed up with the hot climate, है ना? So dear friends, uh, everybody is ready to learn something new and different in EVS. Yes, you are all very smart. I I knew it very well because you all always ready to learn new and different things. Is in EVS because EVS is a subject. EVS is a, is not only a subject. EVS uh, makes you learn something new, new, new things because. whatever things you can see around you sometimes you know their names sometimes you know to their name but you don't know more information about those things hai na so in evs you will you can collect so many information about not only for human body not only for plant not only for living and non living things but you will you will connect so so you will collect so many good information about the things whatever things you can see around you okay so everybody is ready with evs book and pencil okay you all are very good so open your evs book and take out chapter number 2 food what is the chapter number 2 chapter number 2 food okay so dear students about the chapter number 2 food you already ha you already have attended three zoom classes which was live interaction hai na which was the live learning okay and this is part number 3 this is part number part number 3 which you are going to watch in this video okay so dear students uh, before it starts learning something new and different in evs once again i am going to take the small recap hai na so chapter number 2 food in this chapter we will learn the different sources of the food and the different food groups so there are two sources of food plants and animals right so in plants we all are eating the each and every part of the plant but directly we can't make we all are eating in the form of food hai na then animals animals also providing us so many things all the milk product we have because of animals only if cow will not provide us milk how we can get the milk how we can get the butter paneer cheese and so many items which is made by only the milk hai na then hai egg and meat also hai na then we discussed about the vegetarian non vegetarian vegetarian and vegan people hai na and the yesterday's video you have seen what you have we already have discussion uh, we already had a discussion on food groups hai na so i told you that what is nutrient what is nutrients okay so in this category we discussed about the protein hai na protein protein is a very very important part which our body needs which our body requires and what are the various sources to get the protein i told you that pulses milk cheese nuts wheat egg fish meat these all are the certain sources of the of the protein hai na and one more important information about protein is that protein ko we can call it grow food also g r o w grow f w o d food we can call it we have see we human beings have two names one is nickname and one is real name so as like that protein is also have another name we can call it grow food also okay then what else the work of the protein what protein is exactly doing when it will reaches in our body so protein helps us when we will get injured suppose you you are riding your bicycle and suddenly unfortunately you fell down you fell down then what will happen sometimes some child have get 
severe injury but whatever injury is there the work of protein to fill that injury hai na and one more information about that protein is protein is grow food also when we will include when we will involve the uh, protein uh, protein uh, uh, when we will involve the food items which have protein so we can grow up nicely so that is the reason we can call it grow food also then carbohydrates there are so many various sources of carbohydrate rice wheat sugar potato banana bread wheat bread root these all are the sources of carbohydrate and carbohydrate gives us instant energy and that is the reason the another name of the carbohydrate is go food understand this much ye dono baatein samajh mein aayi hope you are very smart you can understand now fat fat ab what are the various sources of fat butter ghee oil like groundnut oil and coconut oil these all are the various sources to get the fat hai na and when we will involve the fat as in our diet so the main work of the fat to give our body warm hai na and that fat help us to help us to keep our skin human beings skin glowing and soft that is the reason we can call fat glow food also glow means chamakdar chamkeela shining wala then vitamins all the fruits all the vegetables each and every type of fruits each and every type of vegetables when we will have so we will get we will get a fit body and all these are the protective food these all are protecting us from the diseases hai na this all, all these discussion we had in the last class so today today it's time to discuss about minerals
a very rich source of calcium and a glass of milk is the rich source of calcium it is already written is in your book also aapke book mein bhi ye baat likhi hui hai okay so understand about the minerals what do you understand minerals is also a important nutrients which our body requires and the calcium and the iron these are called the minerals and in milk and spinach these two are the rich sources of minerals when we will talk about milk so milk is a rich source of calcium and when we will include a glass of milk is in our daily routine then our bones and our teeth get strong and then iron iron is the rich source of iron is the rich source of calcium iron is the rich source of calcium also and uh, spinach is the rich source of iron palak spinach is the rich source of the iron iron means loha hai na and most of the kids are not like to eat spinach the palak ki sabzi pasand nahi aati hai but this is not good for their health okay now we will discuss about the fiber fiber okay this is the next nutrient last but not least fiber so what are the various sources to get the fiber number 1 and how many things we are getting what kind of nutrient we are getting when we will include this fiber is in our diet let's see what is written is in your book first then step by step i will make you understand number 1 whole grains number 1 whole grains whole grains whole grains means all types of anaj jitne bhi anaj aate hain jitne bhi anaj aate hain that is called grains that is called grains hai na and fruits and vegetables and all type of fruits and vegetables सारी बीमारियों की जड़ 
अगर हमारा पेट होता है इफ आर स्टमक इज क्लीन रेगुलरली देन डेफिनेटली वी विल नॉट फॉल सिंग एंड वी विल नॉट फेस टू एनी अदर डिसीज इन फ्यूचर ऑल्सो दैट इज द रीजन एवरीबडी इज से पेट सफा हर रोग दफा ओके सो ऑलवेज इंक्लूड दी सेलेक्ट ऑलवेज है ऑल टाइप्स ऑफ वेजिटेबल्स ऑल टाइप्स ऑफ फ्रूट्स एंड दी ग्रेन्स ऑल्सो दीज आर दी रिसोर्सेज ऑफ फाइबर ओके सो हियर वी आर कंप्लीटिंग हीट इंफॉर्मेशन अबाउट दी फूड ग्रुप्स इंफॉर्मेशन अबाउट दी फूड ग्रुप्स इन दिस कैटेगरी नंबर वन प्रोटीन वी ऑलरेडी डिस्कस्ड नंबर टू कार्बोहाइड्रेट वी ऑलरेडी डिस्कस्ड नंबर थ्री फैट्स वी ऑलरेडी डिस्कस्ड नंबर फोर वाइटमिन वी ऑलरेडी डिस्कस्ड नंबर फिफ्थ मिनरल्स वी ऑलरेडी डिस्कस्ड एंड नंबर सिक्स फाइबर सो देर आर सिक्स sources of the food group which we call it nutrient which we call it nutrient okay so understand all these things so we understand well now today we will discuss about the balanced diet what is a balanced diet They will not get sugar. They will not get vitamin, 
and they will not get minerals also so this milk listen very carefully pay attention towards my words this milk plays a very 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 important role because milk have all five things which are body needed protein fat sugar vitamin and minerals and most of the children you are avoiding to drink milk you are avoid to drink milk this is you are avoiding to drink milk this is very bad this is very uh, very very means the 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 the, the, the dirty habit you have actually okay so always drink milk this is number 1 now number 2 number 1 what number 1 milk hai na and milk ke saath saath mein salad salad plays also a important role then water water is also play always the important role and we must always drink plenty of water in a day plenty of water so many students like adya mittal adya's mama always told me that ma'am please you always pin my daughter because she is not drinking much of water so adya mittal always drink lots of water when you will drink lots of water your skin will shine your stomach will clean and you will feel hungry hai na and you will grow nicely because this water is also a important part of a balanced diet and we always drink a plenty of water at least 8 to 10 glasses of water in a day whenever we will drink keep the numbers is in your mind that सुबह से उठी तो एक ग्लास पानी पी लिया है ना देन टू ग्लास हो गए थ्री हो गए सो कीप द नंबर्स ओवर हियर इज इन योर माइंड व्हेन यू विल ड्रिंक द वाटर कीप द नंबर्स फिट ओवर देयर सो यू विल नॉट फॉरगेट हाउ हाउ मेनी ग्लासेस ऑफ वाटर यू ड्रिंक ओके नाउ व्हाट इज द फंक्शन ऑफ द वाटर मींस व्हाट इज द सी वी आर तो ड्रिंकिंग प्लेंटी ऑफ वाटर बट this water this water help to remove the body waste actually jo hamari body mein jitna bhi toxin banta hai whatever toxin is made by our body it will remove nicely when we will have when we will drink lots of water it will remove nicely by our body through the urine and sweat hai na pani aur pasina जब हम बहुत ज्यादा पानी पियेंगे हमारा यूरिन क्लियर होगा और हमारी स्वेट से हमारी बॉडी का सारा टॉक्सिन बाहर आ जाएगा ओके सो वॉटर इज ऑल्सो प्लेट एन एसेंशियल रोल इज इन अ बैलेंस डाइट नाउ द लास्ट बट नॉट लीस्ट पॉपुलर डिशेज ऑफ सम स्टेट्स बहुत सारी स्टेट्स की पॉपुलर डिश के बारे में हम डिस्कस करेंगे यू कैन सी देर आर सो मेनी पिक्चर्स आगे वन इज इन योर बुक यू कैन सी देर आर सिक्स नाइन पिक्चर्स ऑफ द डिफरेंट डिफरेंट स्टेट्स एंड द डिफरेंट डिफरेंट फूड आइटम्स ओके सो लेट्स डिस्कस अबाउट दोज सो लुक एट द पिक्चर डिशेज ऑफ सम स्टेट्स ऑफ इंडिया देर आर सो मेनी पॉपुलर स्टेट्स वी हैव वी हैव ट्वेंटी एट स्टेट्स एंड seven union territories you will learn all these things okay now number 1 makke ki roti and sarso ka saag it is very very famous is in punjab beta ye thodi si cheeze hoti hai jo aapko yaad karni padengi these things you have to memorize now dal bati and churma it is very famous in rajasthan dal bati and churma it is not only famous is in rajasthan dal bati and churma it is famous in malwa and nimad also people those who are living in nimad area as well as living in malwa area they are liking to eat dal bati and churma dhokla yes dhokla is very famous is in gujarat tarak mehta ka ulta chashma mein that jethalal family belongs to the gujarat and they always talking about the gujarati food hai na then momos momos is very very famous is in mizoram and idli dosa and sambar idli dosa and sambar too it is famous in all over india not only in all over india wherever the indians are living they like to eat the south indian food and the speciality of south indian food is there is no spice
राइस बहुत ज़्यादा तेल और मसाले नहीं होते हैं इसलिए साउथ इंडियन फूड 